I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Cobras. Today, Today is Friday, Friday November, November 18th. 18th. I'm Riley. I'm Preston. You're watching HAC News. What's happening at HAC? Today's lunch options are ham, cheese, croissant sandwich, powdered donuts, and cinnamon toast crunch bar. Picture retakes have been rescheduled to December 6th. HAC is going to NASA. Cambridge Science students are invited to attend. The cost is $60 with payment, and it's due by November the 29th. The holiday Ho 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 Down Dance will be Tuesday, December 6th from 1.30 p.m. to 3.30 p.m. Tickets are $5 and can be purchased during lunch. Missing anything? Did you know we have a lost and found in the clinic as well as the cafeteria? Stop by and pick up items that belong to you. And now to sports. Next girls basketball game is November the 30th against Chasco Middle High School at Chasco. Boys soccer is November 29th against, against Chasco Middle School at Wendell Corinne High School. All sporting events tickets can be purchased on GoFan. Remember, Cobras are engaged, innovative, reflective, responsible, and confident. It's Thanksgiving break next week, which means no school. Have an awesome break. <laughs> Stay tuned for Book Talk with Ella and Maxine. And I'm Ella, and this is Book Talk. Today we talk about the book, The Beast in the Bethany. In The Beast in Bethany, Adventure Tweezer has spent nearly all of his 511 years living alone in a beautiful mansion with beautiful things. But not all beautiful things. There's a beast in his attic. And to the perfect, beastly meal, Bethany is a, frankly, a dreadful child living at the Institute for Damn Manly Boys and Ladylike Ladies. Would Bethany be friend-worthy? Come on down to the library to read Beast and Bethany by award-winning author Jake Meggett Phillips. I hope everyone has a great Thanksgiving feast. I don't know about you, but for me, I really like corn. What do you like about corn? It's corn! 